one of the interesting thing is they are also offering a Mixtral 8x7b instruct API for free. This one is Google's Gemini Pro and it costs nothing. The golden age of API war has just started and I'm so excited to bring this video out to you to discuss all the opportunities out there regardless whether you are a small business owner who is just looking to write this AI wave or if you are an entrepreneur who is looking to launch your next AI startup or a hobbyist like me who try to play around latest technologies. Hi, my name is Avijit. You are watching Note Together where I try to simplify latest tech and innovations for your future and your business. Let's get started. This week was so interesting in terms of API cost announcement that I just couldn't hold myself from recording this video and break it down for you without doing any planning. Before I start this episode and see the crazy price drops of the APIs, let's first get familiarized with a few of the terminologies, especially for the people who are just new to the AI space or rather the AI API space. Now API is application programming interface. Think of it like a tool that helps two applications talk to each other. Like for example, when you go to ChatGPT and give it an instructions, that is more sort of human to application communication. Now, if you want to create an application that you want to talk to ChatGPT, you would need something called API. So your application would usually call ChatGPT's API in this case. The API provider, which is OpenAI here, would generally charge you for consuming their APIs. And in AI space, these charges are mostly based on tokens. Now, what is tokens? The tokens are more like words. Let's see an example. This is OpenAI's tokenizer page. Here you can actually enter some text and you can see how much token that it's going to cost. If I say, how are you? This is like three words, but it's kind of costing four tokens because there are space, this is a question mark and all this. Now, one thing to remember is because primarily most of the AI models are trained on English language. So your token is almost equal to the number of words. However, if you want to use another language, for example, if I type something in Bengali, which is my mother language by the way and then if i change it which is only two words you see it's costing me like 13 tokens now that the concept of api and tokens are clear let's go and see some crazy price drop let's start with openai because that will set a benchmark for our comparison openai have multiple ai models such as gpt4 gpt3.5 gpt4 is state-of-the-art model so we will compare mostly GPT-3.5 pricing structure with all the other models. In AI API space, you have both input and output. That means when you are giving an instructions to the model, that is input. And then whatever the model is generating, that is output. So you will be charged for both your input words and then the output words that's been generated by the AI model. So roughly it costs around $1 per million tokens because it's like 0 0.0010 per thousand tokens and then output cost around two dollar for a million tokens one of the things that you should also note here gpt 3.5 turbo supports 16k context window that means it can keep around 16,000 tokens in its context window when it is responding so if you are making a chat like applications where you need to remember the previous conversation user had with your apps that means the language model you need to use should have some kind of short-term memory. Now for GPT 3.5 Turbo, that is 16K tokens, which is almost like 14,000 words. Now let's go and compare it with the next one, which is Anthropic. This is also kind of a competitor to OpenAI. Now Anthropic has three models, Cloud Instant, Cloud 2.0 and 2.1. One of the interesting thing with Cloud is that they have minimum 100,000 tokens window, which is almost like 75,000 words. And their cost is almost like uh, almost like 80 cents per million tokens for input and $2.40 per million tokens as output. Just to give you a context, a million tokens is almost like all the seven books of Harry Potter together. So next one is Mistral model. So if you are in the AI space, you have definitely heard about Mistral. Specifically, they have recently released a model called Mistral 87B, which is performing better than GPT 3.5 Turbo. Um, if you look at their pricing, and even if you consider like the Mistral small model is sufficient for the general AI applications, that would cost 60 cents per million tokens. So if you compare it with OpenAI pricing, you are having like a dollar per million tokens. And yes, it has a bit more output cost, but it's still less than OpenAI because in OpenAI GPT 3.5 Turbo, it costs almost like $2 per million tokens. Okay, next for the comparison, interestingly, we came to uh, any scale. I know for the matter that any scale is being used by a lot of the developers out there who are trying different AI applications. 
um, I personally have also used any skill in my personal projects. Now here, if you see the same mixtral model, which is 8x7b instruct, that only cost 50 cents per million tokens. So the official mistral, they are charging like 60 cents per million token input and output, like 1.8 dollar or euro, uh, whereas any scale is only costing 50 cents per million tokens. They don't have even any output cost, which is insane. And if you're really new into the AI space, this is way, way cheaper than it used to be. Now let's talk about together.ai API pricing. Uh, they also have the same mixtral model, 8x7b, that is also costing same like um, 60 cents per million tokens. And that brings to our super excited announcement of free APIs. This one is Google's Gemini Pro and it costs nothing. So it costs free for 60 query per minute, which will help hobbies like me to create projects absolutely free. While all other models are charging based on tokens, Google is charging based on characters. And I'm not sure what their go to market strategy is, but character seems a bit less because if I say, who are you, that's almost Three, six, nine, ten, eleven characters. So I think whereas it's only taking three tokens, um, the Google Gemini would consider it like ten to eleven characters. And I think they are trying to compete with OpenAI or Anthropic, and that is why they are making the pricing structure um, absolutely free to onboard a lot of the developers who start using their model. The final one, and this is like nail in the coffin, is OpenRouter.ai. I absolutely love these guys because they provide a lot of the open source large language model. In discounts or sometimes it's 100 off for example you have mistral 7 billion instruct model for free it's not going to cost you anything and it has like 8000 context window one of the interesting thing is they are also offering mistral 8x7b instruct api for free i mean how crazy is that and it has like 32,000 context window you can build absolutely crazy apps with this and for free so that's it for today's video i was really excited about the api cost announcement this week and I hope this brings much value to you. Please don't forget to like and subscribe the channel and I'll see you on the next one.